Here is a set of multiple choice questions on exponents and logarithms. So I have compiled all these from previous 10 years of test papers. I would like you to go through them, copy them, solve, get your choice and then look into my solution or suggestions. Okay, that way you will get a good review on this chapter. Question 1. Another way of writing 16 equals to 2 to the power of 4 is, so we have four different choices. Log of 4, to, of log to the base 4 of 2 equals 16, log to the base 2 of 4. So the four choices are log to the base of 4 of 2 equals to 16, log 2 of 4 equals to 16, log 2 of 16 equals to 4, log to the base 16 of 2 equals to 4. Question 2. Evaluate log 0 0.000001. Choices are minus 4, minus 6, minus 5, minus 7. Question 3. Evaluate log to the base 4 of 16 to the power of 5. Choices are 64, 20, 262, 144 and 10. So try to do your work on the side and then write down the answers. Here are my suggestions. To write from exponential to log form we should take log on both sides. correct? So we get log of 16 equals to log of 2 to the power of 4. Now when we take log on both sides, we should keep same base. That is important. Base of exponential function here is 2 and therefore the base should be 2. That is kind of critical, right? So the left side is log to the base 2 of 16 and here we know from power rule it is 4 times log to the base 2 of 2. Log to the base 2 of 2 is 1 so we get 4 here, right? So log to the base 2 of 16 equals to 4 is the correct answer, which is option C. Question 2. Evaluate this number. So this number could be written as log. If nothing is mentioned here, the base is 10. As 10 to the power of minus 6, and therefore the option is B. Question 3 log to the base 4 of 16 to the power of 5. So we can write this as log to the base 4. 16 in terms of 4 is 4 square, right? So 4 square to the power of 5, correct? So that means we can write this as log to the base 4 of 4 to the power of 5 times 2, okay? 5 times 2 is 10. And therefore the solution is 10, okay? That will give us 10, correct? So that is how you find the answers. I would like you to move on with this multiple set and you should actually stop the video and copy all the questions. Once you have answered the questions, then you look into my suggestion and check your answers. That will help you to understand this topic very well. Thank you and all the best.